large but yeah we're watching this apparently I'm... The killing that'll obviously be going on what yeah apparently you play the killer clowns from outer space what the hell Design director at Alphonic. I never watched the movie as a kid because I don't do scary movies but as a human your goal is to escape the invasion oh it's multiplayer this means you need to locate various escape routes so it's just by daylight items to open them before maybe the apocalypse detonates. There are several options when it comes to escapes for humans, all of which are randomized and, uh, and require a different Hopefully it's actually good. If you're you know, a bunch of Dead by Daylight clones are usually shit. Need to perform these necessary steps, Except for like, like and defending yourself. Friday, oh, there's the clown. The town of Crescent Cove is well located on a... Did he just yeah, turn him into a nutsack? I think he turned him into a bowling pin. No, he's a cotton candy. He turned him into a cotton candy because they're like clowns. This looks like, like circus scene. Oh. Yeah, they're trying to escape the killer clowns. So if you're in a group of four, you'll have to figure things out. I never saw the movie. This is Friday the 13th. On your own. You get no, the whole thing was supposed to be like the clowns are actually aliens, the and they landed on. No, this, but she like, means by gameplay wise. I mean gameplay. Oh, gameplay, yeah. Yeah, yeah it just looks like it. Generator and a special access card to open the door via the keypad. Be sure to prepare for the door open because once it's open, it's open for a very limited time and only as oh, for three humans. After that, you're out of luck and you'll need to find another escape opportunity. I mean, three is pretty good if you just have four players. Strange looking contraption is the portal machine. What? The ever vigilant Wesker Newton found a way to reverse engineer some clown tech, and well, now there's a clown tech. Humans will need to find a spark plug, then interact to open up the portal. This needs to be held open for others to escape through. While you can hold it open as long as you'd like, letting go of the portal controls will cause the portal to start closing, but will stay open just long enough for you to slip through. Once the portal fully collapses, a new spark plug is needed to open it. Okay. There are several types of barricaded gate exits that can exist around the exterior of maps. Finding a gate key will give you the ability to open up the gate that is blocking these derelict escapes. So showing different ways you can escape. Yeah, escapes. different these ways to escape, but what about the clowns? The that needs to be smashed down with melee weapons, which can be extremely noisy. Yeah. Once okay. through this barricade, you can use the gate key and escape through the precarious exit. If too many humans have tread through these areas, the routes will collapse, preventing oh. any further escape. It's also worth noting that clowns have the ability to coat each of these escapes with cotton candy blocking. <laughs> really? Escape progress and must be cleared off before you can continue escape. That's fucking Watch goofy. Out, though, because failing quick time events while clearing cotton candy or Oh, so that's a dead by daylight thing. Can signal the clowns of your presence. While all of these escape options are ideal, so this reminds me so much of Death by Daylight and Friday the 13th. Yeah, it's not a bad idea for a fusion. Oh, eight humans. You see, it's eight humans. Oh my god. It'll be up to any remaining humans to get there in time, and up to the clown. That's why there's like at zero seconds the clown apocalypse yeah. detonates. Clown apocalypse. Oh my god. What the fuck? I didn't even watch the movie when I was little because it's such a fucking goofy movie. No, at the end there is like a giant clown spider. We hope you have that's the main character's fight. Of course. Invading June 4th. Like that's we'll the whole part of like the movie. It's just, it's just cute. It's just. It's just fucking goofy like B movie. Yeah, and it's like a funny, silly, goofy. It actually has a really cool like theme song. Well, that. Good, at as, least. Okay, as I was saying, here is the line from the from the show, and it said from one of the characters, "I could say used to be oh an my old God. crappy town." Okay, well, but after you say that, <laughs> um, okay, Dado, before you finish that, thank all of you for stopping by, and what do you just react to? I don't even know what the hell to describe killer clowns from outer space of the game, and we'll see you guys all later. Bye.